there has been a massive pump up in the price of Bitcoin over the last few days. Just recently in the last 24 hours, we have seen this huge pump right here. So in this video, I want to give you guys a huge update on exactly what is happening in the crypto market. So why is the price of Bitcoin going up? What can happen in October? So some people are saying October is a very good month for crypto. And it does look like that is the case right now. Plus some other critical news. And at the end of the video, we're going to be checking out some cryptos that are down from their all time high. So you have to remember right now we are still in a somewhat bearish market even though the crypto prices are going up so we're going to be checking out some cryptos from their all-time high at the end of this video so if that sounds good to you guys hit the thumbs up button let's get into the video so the first thing you need to know in the crypto market right now it is a sea of green in the crypto market so if you have altcoins in your portfolio generally speaking a lot of your cryptos should be going up today so why is that happening that is happening because right now the price of bitcoin has been surging so you can see right here monster buy-in from around the twenty-seven thousand dollars it pushed it all the way up above twenty-eight thousand dollars and uh, so big money big buys are coming into the bitcoin market right now you you guys know uh, in the background of crypto what you need to be paying attention to is there are ETFs in the pipeline uh, big crypto ETFs Bitcoin ETFs Ethereum ETFs once that money comes online potentially we can see some more explosive moves to the upside into some bullish news have a look at this Google Cloud is now a validator on the Polygon network so according to Polygon the same infrastructure used to power YouTube and Gmail will help secure its network and guys if that's not a bullish sign I don't know what is because that is very very exciting so if you're watching this video on YouTube right now so the same power is going to come behind Polygon very soon and it says here Polygon Labs announced on September the 29th that Google Cloud has joined the Polygon proof of stake network as a validator Google Cloud joins over 100 other validators verifying transactions on its layer 2 Ethereum network so that is hugely exciting and again you know the world's biggest companies such as Google them even in Investing, becoming a validator in a crypto network is a sign that they know crypto is the future and something else that is very futuristic is solarium so guys we have some big announcements for solarium coming up this week as well so shout out to solarium sponsor of the channel and if you guys do not know this crypto as well it is a renewable energy blockchain pioneering proof of generation validation technology on the world's first sustainable layer one blockchain so it's always a very good idea to know about new cryptos in the market because half the battle in crypto is uh, you know learning about cryptos before they potentially explode into the top 50 top 100 right here and some big news about solarium this week is check it out guys so from london to amsterdam and now to barcelona solarium chain is spreading its reach across the globe october the 3rd 2023 solarium is set to shine at SmartCon 2023 by Chainlink in barcelona making its presence felt in this monumental event and the visionary architect behind this crypto samuel reed so if you don't know this guy he actually taught Elon Elon Musk's kids mathematics and that is a true story so absolutely crazy so that is looking super exciting right there so if you are tuning in from Barcelona guys watch out for that event from Chainlink Solarium will be there and if you want to learn more about Solarium I'm going to leave a link to their website right here in the description of the video but some very exciting things coming out so October the 3rd that is tomorrow and you can jump into the telegram if you want to learn more chat to the community in there some other very exciting news happening in the crypto market is Microsoft to form nuclear power team to support artificial intelligence so Microsoft is forming a new team of professionals to advance its artificial intelligence plans with small modular reactors and micro reactors so wow this is looking interesting and I have told you guys artificial intelligence I actually think this thing this is going to be absolutely crazy in the next couple of years so it's going to be very good for technology but I, at the same time I think it will put a lot of people out of work so it's going to be a bit of a dilemma for society but it does say right here they are hiring a professional to develop an energy strategy based on small modular reactors and micro reactor energy so they're looking for a principal program manager who will lead its nuclear technology efforts to support the development of AI models and I have to say guys you know Microsoft diversifying into nuclear power and this is exactly kind of what you have to do if you want to remain a leading company company in the world okay so they're very big on computers but now now they're potentially looking into artificial intelligence and nuclear power and I'm also a big fan of diversifying in the crypto market as well so I have a very diversified portfolio but Microsoft looking to diversify right there the innovate head of the Bank of International Settlements has told central banks need to prepare whether they like crypto or not so they are saying right here tokenized
tokenization could be revolutionary. So you guys know crypto technology, it is changing the way the world uh, works at the moment. And uh, you guys listening to this video, you guys are early because you guys know there's lots of tokens out there that can do lots of exciting things. And people are basically telling the central banks, you need to get ready for crypto. And if you're not ready, you will be left in the dust. And that is 100% the truth right there. Part of the reason the crypto prices are pumping, so Bitcoin has pumped recently, I think it has to do with an aversion also of what's happened in the US. So it says here, Dow Futures jumps more than 100 points after lawmakers avert government shutdowns. So you guys know, if you've been tuning into the news for the last uh, forever in the US, they always have these shutdowns and uh, they've pushed out the window by more than 45 days to you know keep discussions open so they can finalize funding legislation. But again, there was a bit of FUD regarding this, but they've just said they've extended it out right now. They're gonna do it for 45 more days, discuss what's happening right here. And that's actually pushed up the stock market. It's pushed up the futures market. And uh, a bit of that impact has also went into the crypto market right now. So that is a little bit of a bullish momentum in the macro economy. And uh, Joe Biden right now is attacking X. Okay, so let's listen into this because X is actually a big hub for crypto. Joe Biden is attacking it. Let's have a listen into what exactly what Joe Biden says and then what CZ of Binance has to say about this as well. Let's play it. What about what Elon Musk has done to Twitter? Uh, lowering guardrails against misinformation. Does that contribute to it? Yeah, it does. Look, one of the things, as I said to you, when I thought I wasn't going to run, I was going to write a book about the changes taking place. And most of it's directed over the years with these fundamental changes in society by changing technology. Mm -hmm. Gutenberg printing in the printing press changed the way Europeans could talk to one another all the way to today. Where, where do people get their news? They, 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 you know, they go on the internet, they, 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 they go online, they go, and you have no notion whether it's true or not. So that is what Joe Biden is saying about X uh, right now. But you have to remember before X and other types of uh, social media platforms were available, you know, what was the alternative? You only had a few news channels to tune into and they had a lot of power in society. But right now, people can tune into whatever they want, wherever they want, and you get complete freedom over what news you uh, tune into. I actually think it's a really good thing. So Elon Musk is democratizing the news process. I honestly think that's great. And uh, CZ of Binance has jumped in right here. So Elon Musk has said the more they claim that X is failing, the more they damage what little credibility they have and the more X grows. So guys, 100%. So if you don't have an X account, I do think it's good. So you get some good news, direct news, where you can be the judge of the information. You don't need some spin from mainstream media telling you, you know, that Bitcoin's a scam or your other cryptos are a scam. You get to choose what you want, make your own decisions. And CZ of Binance right here says applies not only to X. So again, CZ, he has been fudded. The Binance Crypto Exchange has been fudded. And again, you know, they do want to fud Binance because, you know, we are seeing the prelude to potentially huge Wall Street money coming in in the form of ETFs in the form of uh, Ethereum ETFs as well. And that's going to be very, very exciting in the future. And guys, let's check out the overall crypto prices today. So again, the whole entire crypto market mostly pumping. This has been led by some very nice gains in the price of Bitcoin. So again, that is a nice candle. It's always great to see these kind of parabolic candles uh, for your crypto. So if you're ever holding an altcoin, you see this, you're like, yes, I love these. I love these uh, green candles. So it's, it's the ascending star. So the ascending star looks great there. And uh, if we jump over to these coin gecko prices you can see you know bitcoin pumps 3.5 percent the rest of the crypto market is basically going to pump so solana having a very nice run up 11.4 percent doge creeping up 1.5 percent shiba inu up 2.2 percent casper up 4.1 percent xrp up 1.2 percent and uh, terra classic up 1.4 percent today so guys a lot of the cryptos are starting to push up right now this is looking good and if we actually check out this website you know even though the crypto prices are pumping right now, I actually think you guys are in a great position because a lot of people, they're not in crypto right now. They're going to come into crypto. They're going to FOMO in when the Bitcoin price, you know, hits 40 grand, 50 grand, 60 grand, 70 grand in the future in the next bull run. But right now we can see uh, just here how high we are still off the all time highs right now. So Bitcoin's trading at around a 60% discount. Ethereum, 64% discount off its all time high. XRP, 68% off its all time high. And some of these other cryptos go into like 90% plus. So Cardano, 91%, Doge, 91%, SHIB, 91% off its all-time high. 
And uh, this is the power of the next bull run we're looking at. So again, these crypto prices start to pump in the next bull run, guys. You can see some very, very nice gains, especially if you compare it to the stock market. So in the stock market, if you get, you know, five to 10% per year, you'd be happy with that. In crypto, you guys know you can get absolutely crazy, phenomenal gains, but it does come with that uh, risk and reward as well. But again, you have to be in it to win it. You can see Terra Classic down relatively huge, uh, 100% right there, because you guys know the price of Terra Classic in the past was like 100 plus dollars right there but guys that is a huge update if you guys enjoyed it hit the thumbs up button appreciate you guys watching this video go have a good one i'll see you guys in the next one crypto zeus signing out